All right, public service announcement right fast. Got to put some things on your mind. If anybody's curious about anything, if there's anything that you want to question me about or anything that you just don't know that you would just like an answer to, I'm not hard to find. I'm not hard to contact. You can leave me a comment. You can get at me on Twitter. You could email me. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm not hard to find. But I will tell you, if you're curious about me and you're looking for answers, one place that you won't find it is on a racist person's channel. So I would advise you before you go to any place talking about me and what you don't understand, you might want to come past my house first and see if you can get those answers. So therefore, you won't have to walk around feeling like that. You know, because if you stopped here first, you could have got those answers. But instead, you go across the street to get answers about your neighbor. Anyways, I'm going to digress on that. The other thing I want to say is this. You content creators, you guys going to have to focus on your own damn channel. You guys are going to have to focus on your own content. All right? Because... It's not fun anymore. You guys are not creative anymore. All you guys do, you, you know who you guys are? You're the Avengers. All you want to do is go around and counter content instead of making boxing content. I'm not worried about what comes off anybody else's channel. I don't have to agree what comes off of your channel. That don't compel me to make a video about you. It doesn't make me angry. It doesn't make me want to bash you. It doesn't make me feel no kind of way whatsoever. I recognize that it's different strokes for different folks. And whether I think what you're saying is crazy or not, there's people out there who like what you're talking. So keep doing your thing. But all these content creators who's making content about other content creators is weak as fuck. I'm not worried about you. You guys should not be worried about me. What content you, you make, it does not anger me. But what I make angers y'all and you guys are baffled and confused. But you know what, guys? I'm confused, too. Because I got a question, too. And I've asked, but I can't, you know, I, I just don't get an answer. So the question is this. Why do y'all care if I like Vasily Lomachenko so damn much? That's what I want to know. Why do y'all care about what I say about him? The most least talked about fighter on my platform. He's the least talked about fighter on my platform. He's the least talked about fighter on everybody's platform. Okay? But yet, when I say something about him, just like I do anybody else, I sound like a broken record. You guys want to cry. Why? This is why I say Lomachenko fans are the weakest you know because i know their fucking weakness and it's not boxing that's why i can toy with you like this this is why you guys walk around like i don't understand bruce this this and that. this is why you guys make subliminal videos this is why you do it you didn't have to make subliminal videos you guys can come to me <laughs> you guys can come to me i sit back and i laugh because actually it just make me feel like the Dalai Lama of this shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm just a king on top of the mountain just looking down on all y'all. Because everybody's worried. Everybody watches my move. Everybody cares about my content. Everybody cares about my opinion. I create content for other content creators. Okay? I've even fucking spawned y'all. Who don't know that YB ain't my bastard son? Okay? It wasn't no 78 sports slayer or none of that. Who do you think he catered himself after? You know what I'm saying? All you motherfuckers. I don't watch all y'all steal my style. I don't watch all y'all steal my lingo, steal my word phrases, all that shit. Now you're landlords. Now you're making uh, fanboy chronicles or something like that. Just jack that. Now you understand what follow the leader is about? It's about me trying to do my own thing and everybody jocking my coattail while I do it when they need to worry about their own fucking channel. All y'all been here three and four years longer than me. Worry about your own damn channel. And if you got a question, come and ask me. Don't get in your feelings. 
Don't go make Clarissa Shield videos and stuff like that because that was a chance that you could have came and asked me something. You know what I'm saying? Instead, you want to make videos. Yeah, I knew it. You know I knew it. I can separate feelings from what people can do professionally. You know what I'm saying? Just like I say all the time, I've been separate talent from my personal feelings. You know? And as far as that goes, I thought that you had a good channel. A good boxing channel. Therefore, I didn't see no reason to go at a good boxing channel. But Ring IQ, if you're curious about something, bro, come ask me. Don't be like these bitches out here. Don't make subliminal videos. Come hit me up, this, this, and that. Or say, hey, Bruce, i like to have you on. Or i like, because I just want to chop it up with you. And it's that uh, when y'all do this backdoor shit, when y'all do this complaining shit, when y'all all huddle up, you know, you know what I'm saying? When a big kid is out of the classroom, you know what I'm saying? Talking all that shit. This will make me believe that, you know what I'm saying? You got blood type bitch. You know? So if you're curious, Come ask me, you know, I mean, it's not fucking hard. Stop making videos about my fucking videos. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just saying that to you. I'm saying that to all you motherfuckers because y'all still do it to this fucking day. But then again, if you just can't come up with no fucking content, then you know what I'm saying? Help yourself. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind helping the needy. 